Several news reports published today have highlighted the vital role of oxygen in treating patients with severe and critical COVID-19 left untreated. Severe COVID-19 deprives cells and organs of the oxygen they need, which ultimately leads to organ failure and death. Medical oxygen is produced using oxygen concentrators which extract and purify oxygen from the air. WHO estimates that at the current rate of about 1 million new cases a week, the world needs about 620,000 cubic meters of oxygen a day, which is about 88,000 large cylinders. However, many countries are now experiencing difficulties in obtaining oxygen concentrators 80% of the market is owned by just few companies and demand is currently outstripping supply. Ongoing talks with suppliers in recent weeks have enabled WHO to buy 14,000 oxygen concentrators, which will be sent to 120 countries in the coming weeks. Another challenge is that many patients with critical disease need a higher flow rate of oxygen than is produced by most commercially available concentrators. To address this challenge, WHO is supporting several countries to buy equipment that will enable them to generate their own concentrated oxygen in larger amounts. This is just one way in which WHO is continuing to support countries with science, solidarity, and solutions.